like to say Jesus is for you in big situations. You know, Jesus is for you when you're going through some of the stuff I've already talked about, through depression, if you've had an abortion, if you struggle with homosexuality, if you struggle with being lonely, all these things, that Christ is for you in those times. But what about the everyday? I mean, when, when life is just going, the comings and goings of life, how is Jesus for you on a daily basis? What does that look like? And think of this. There's this great hymn in our hymnal, hymn 709, The King of Love My Shepherd Is. And there's this stanza, stanza, I don't know how you pronounce the A in that. But this stanza where Jesus, it says, perverse and foolish off I stray. And we do this every day, right? We, we, we sin, we make mistakes, we do wrong things. Instead of walking joyfully in the commandments, you know, it's fun to gossip sometimes. It's easier to get angry. And you know what? The guy next to me had the right answer, and it's like he wanted me to copy it. Something like that, you know? And none of those are right. I'm not saying that's right, but it happens. It shouldn't. It does. It shouldn't. But the thing is, we do go astray. Does Jesus then say, no, these are the little bitty things that you can just kind of fix yourself? No. It says in the stanza continuing, Let in, Yet in love he sought me, and on his shoulders gently laid in home rejoicing brought me. Every day of your life is being carried on the shoulders of Jesus unto your eternal place in the new creation. That's every day of your life. Everything you do is Jesus for you, carrying you unto that new place, unto that greater place where there is no tears, there are, is no pain, there is no sadness, loneliness, there are no abortions, there, are, there is no loneliness, there is no doubt, there is no depression. None of this exists there because it's absolutely perfect. And we won't have any of that struggle anymore. But every day you go through life, we have to remember Jesus is still carrying us, even if it's not a big thing. Think of it this way. You can see someone carrying like a big cross on their back, and that cross is heavy to bear. And you'll say that, oh, they're going through a really hard time in life right now. But most of us don't have that. What we have are a bunch of little pocket crosses, and they're just in our pockets every day more and more and more but it's still a cross it's still something you're bearing and christ bears it for you and with you and he will not forsake you no matter how small you may think that thing is jesus has borne it for you on the cross that he may carry this heavy burden with you to invite you and say come to me ye who labor and are heavy laden and i will give you rest and that's what your lord gives you every day God bless you all. We'll see you next time. Bye-bye. Thanks for watching Higher Things video shorts. Remember to like, subscribe for notifications, and donate to support Higher Things at higherthings.org slash giving. If you like this video, check out our website, higherthings.org, and check out more content from Higher Things.